now who's ready for story time? Can you please read Cinderella? Once upon a time, there was a lovely Cinderella princess. The prince she lifted Cinderella, covered in ashes, up onto the white horse, where they rode off to the castle, where they were to be married and live happily ever after. The end. Let me get this straight. She ran from him. Twice. Yeah, twice. And even when he came to her house, she still waited to be called upon to try in the shoe. That's right. He was saving her from her horrible life and her wretched stepmother. If that were me and I'd been granted a trip in a pumpkin that had mice that turned into horses, I would have seized that opportunity the first time. Yeah, and who does he think he is coming into her house? She left you twice, dude. Read the writing on the wall. My issue with it is the fact that the stepmother tries to saw off the heels and toes of the daughters to make the shoe fit and keep Cinderella cleaning the house the whole time. Why do we, as women, have to hold each other back? Can't we just elevate each other to a higher emotional level instead of focusing on the confines that society puts on us? I agree, Roberta. Going back to the beginning, why do we always need a fairy godmother? You know, someone to fix our lives? We're in control. We have the power to be the girls we want to be. Tell him, sister. You go, girl. Now, who wants to watch Frozen? Bring it ah!